Hey everybody, it's Brandon again. My uh, Chrome OS Flex device here just got updated to version 102, specifically 102.0.4992.0. And so uh, we're just going to take a look here and see what we find different uh, right off the bat. Uh, and the first thing I notice right away is the uh, bar at the bottom auto hides by default now. Um, and when you don't have any windows open, it's open I mean the bars there but uh, as soon as you open something like I got the camera open here or the settings uh, it does the auto hide and you got a mouse down to um, make it reappear don't know if I'm a fan of that I'm sure there's a way to turn it off somewhere personalization perhaps uh, maybe I'll search for hide and see if yeah, I don't know I'll look around for that later but uh, that's the first thing I noticed straight away so, yeah, if you're a fan of that, that might be good. I, so far, I think it's annoying, because half the time it doesn't come up when I want it to. I, come on. Open. There we go. Here's another thing I noticed straight away. Um, and maybe this was there before, and I just didn't notice it. But when I clicked on this, there's now a Manage Linux Sharing option. And I'm sorry if that was there before. Uh, maybe it was, but this is the first time I've seen it. And so shared folders will appear here. Uh, so I think I think that's new. I could be wrong. Now I also read online that apparently the um, there's a new setting which I'm going to try to turn on in a second if I can get my bar to show up. That uh, if you have the calendar widget enabled, it actually breaks your clock down here into two sections, separating notifications from the time and date. And to enable that, I w probably would have to restart my Chromebook. So I might just do a separate video about that. Let me go to Chrome Flags, and um, I'll search for, it might be under Calendar. Okay, Productively Monthly Calendar View. See, I don't think I can enable this without restarting my Chromebook. So I'm not going to do it on this video because it'll stop my recording. I might make a, another video highlighting the monthly calendar view again if it's been updated. So that's one thing to check if you've been updated to 102. Apparently that has been updated and improved. So yeah, that's uh, those are the things I've noticed so far with Chrome OS 102. The release notes are always a little cryptic on this, but if I find more stuff that's been updated, I will definitely post a video and let you guys know. But these are the things I've noticed so far. Um, one thing that has not been fixed that I always check whenever there's an update is my SD card still doesn't work on this laptop. If anyone from Google sees this, this is an Asus L210M. SD card not working on Chrome OS Flex. Just saying. Uh, so yeah, there's that. Oh wait, what is this My Graphics folder? I never noticed that before. I don't know if that came from an app I installed, but I have a new folder in my files called My Graphics. Never seen that one before, so that might be new also. Day modified April 3rd. You know, this could also be something that synced from my uh, regular Chrome OS book. I'm not sure. That's the first time I've ever seen it. So anyway, this is Chrome OS Flex version 102. I got the update. Everything seems to work except for my SD card again. This is auto hiding now. I want to find a way to disable that because half the time I try to get it to come back. It doesn't. Apparently the calendar view has been updated. So yeah. If you guys notice any more changes in Chrome OS Flex 102, let me know in the comments. And uh, if it's anything big and noteworthy, I will make a video about it. And also, if you've been trying Chrome OS Flex and there's stuff on your laptop that hasn't worked, it might be worth trying this new release and maybe they fix some things for you. So there it is. Thanks for watching. I hope you have a good day. Goodbye now.